Porter's Free. So we are going to read you a story today. We're going to read Raccoon on the Moon, which is part of a phonics series. And we're all at different stages of phonics here. So Evie is kind of phase five-ish. Um, and so she is, her job is to listen out for a sound in this story. So what's your sound, Evie? Ooh. Can you show everybody an ooh? Ooh. So if Evie hears an ooh sound, she's going to hold this up for us. Alfie, what's your job? To, learn, to, be the, to do the actions. We're going to all do some actions and you're going to do the rhyming words for me, aren't you? You're listening out for the rhyming words. That's the kind of stage that Alfie's at. And Freddie, what's your job? Um, to read the book. <laughs> to read the book so you're going to listen and read the book with us and you've got your drawing pad haven't you because you like to do drawing sometimes when we're reading a book okay so here we go raccoon on the moon <laughs> she's ready she's got her ooh sound goodbye cries raccoon i'm off to the moon 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 and Good boy, those were the rhyming words. I'll be back by lunchtime or late afternoon. You got the ooh sound, well done, Evie. Goose grins and she giggles. You uh, foolish me. raccoon. Foolish and ooh. Yeah, that's right. You can hear the ooh sound in foolish and raccoon. And you can hear the ooh sound. Can you draw me an ooh? Because. Ooh, ooh. Get ready, guys. This is your actions. Three, two, one. Boom! <laughs> he zooms into space. Wow, so the coon has gone. Three, two, one. Boom! Zoom and boom. Zoom and boom. Well done. Far up to the stars at a fabulous pace. He reaches the moon, but smash, what a shock. His craft crashes bump on a sharp lump of rock. We had shock and rock. The ship hits the ground, it's split down one side. Now I might be stuck here. Raccoon bounds outside. Help! Yelps Raccoon. I'm going too high. I seem to be floating. Can you float like a space man? No. Oh. 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 Keep calm, comes a cry. My name is Zack. I live on the moon. Give me your hand and I'll have you back soon. We tried to talk like an alien, didn't we? How does an alien sound like? Bloop, bloop, bloop. <laughs> bloop, bloop, bloop. My name is Zack. I live on the moon. Give me your hand. Bloop, bloop, bloop. And I'll have you back soon. <laughs> bloop, bloop, bloop. Thanks, Pants Raccoon. And he shows <laughs> Zack his ship. I had a bad landing. Bloop, bloop, bloop. I'll call my friend Zip. So Zack is calling Zip. Zoom. Zip, Zack, zoom. Zip's buggy chugs up. He whips out a tool. Fizz goes his gizmo and the ship is fixed. Cool. Ooh, cool. Let's show you around. Bloop, 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 bloop. Raccoon on the smarty. They bound by a crater, climb mountains, see valleys until three hours later. You were looking for the rhyming words. You got crater and later. Crater, later. Blast off at last, but on the way home, there's clanging and banging. Did I hear a moan? 
The ship reaches Earth. Three cheers for Raccoon. Hip, hip. Hooray. Hip, hip. Hooray. Hip, hip. Hooray. His chums greet their hero. You've been to the moon. Prove it, jeers Goose. Did you bring something back? Yes, indeed, calls a small voice. <gasps> My goodness, it suck! They brought the alien home. Uh oh. Should we draw an alien? I'm gonna have a go at Mommy, drawing an alien. Yeah. What two are same. There's two of the same words. Tell me, what's the same words you can hear? Oh, Mum, you maybe forgot that. Oh. Shush, shush, shush. What do you think of my alien? Can I make one? Okay, your turn. I'm actually going to make one with this one. You're going to draw on a different pad. Mm -hmm. These are great, by the way, if you're looking for um, a really safe way of doing drawing. Um, they're all from Amazon. They're different types. I got it. But um, they're like LCD, so it's like a tablet, um, and you just use this. Oh, uh, but obviously that won't work on anything else. So it, you can only draw on the on the board, and then you press that button, and it's gone. And they're really good, and they're good for putting in your bag, taking out places, um, and of course your pen never dries out. So you can't lose the lid, but you can lose the pen. Um, we've bought this set, Alien. and then I've since seen a set that have got a string attached <laughs> Wow, look at Alfie's alien. Okay, so again, loads more learning going on there. We've done some phonics, we did a little bit of number work in there, and now we're doing some mark making. <laughs> wow, I love that alien. Um, and yeah, some uh, different levels of phonics. So looking for a specific sound, ooh, um, and well done, Alfie, thank you. Uh oh. And so, yeah, these are fancy phonics cards, again, that I bought from a set on Amazon. Um, but you could just write that on a post-it note and that would work just as well. So, oh, look at this alien. That's fantastic. So hopefully you've got um, a few different ideas there of ways of taking something like reading a story and um, pitching it at different levels for a whole family, um, even occupying a little one as well. yep, brilliant Pushy. so i shall leave story time there for today and we'll hopefully see you again soon Bye. 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 Oh, soon. that was a good word see you soon